Shin Virtuality here, back again with The Room 2. And if I'm not mistaken, we should be getting pretty close to wrapping this up. So I'm hoping that we can do it on this one, but if it bleeds over to one more game, uh, then that's what we'll do. Um, like I said, just want to keep these games short, uh, make them nice bite-sized episodes. So um, I think the last one ran a little long, so I'll try and... Uh, uh, get my brain cells going uh, good to see if we can make it past the next room of the room two. Two. Room. Something. Let's continue. Oh. I am actually on a boat. I remember the last thing from the last episode where I looked down, or I, I looked at um, what some sort of vision thing. I, I, I looked at a, 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 a I looked at a thing, and it showed me a boat. And now I'm on the boat. So <laughs> let's see what I have to do. Whoa! I don't need to do that. Uh, okay. Um, oh, I can, I can, trying to, uh, where do I need to go? Can I spin the wheel? I cannot spin the wheel. Ah. All right, well. Lens doesn't do anything. Uh, what do I need to... Oh. Hey. Keep it down over there. Crank handle. Maybe now I can spin the wheel. Yep, that's what I needed. Uh, don't spin the camera. I want to get away from whatever's in the water because it's scaring me. It's a good thing the crank was right there. <gasps> Is this me walking up or the camera walking up? Alright, I'm at a door. It's entering into a room. Um... Chapter complete. Oh, did I not get the chapter complete? I thought I did. Okay, well... <laughs> this would be a really short video if this is it. Uh, Alright. Even short journeys can cover great distance. And by making it to the other side, the crossing, you are now ready for the final step. May good fortune be with you. Well, this concludes our video now. We're going to continue, so... Nice fake out there, room two. Uh-oh, it's a box on a table. And we do have some other stuff about. So let's... Uh, what do we got here? What do we got here? Ah, oh, it looks like something can fit in here. Yes, of course it does. I am no stranger to this. Oh, that needs that needs some sort of key, but at least I can spin the lock around. That's neat. I've never seen that before. And there's a bucket of glass. All right, nothing from the lens. Uh, can I see through? Nope. Let's check everything. And, hmm. Can I see the top of the box, please? Please. No. No. Garg. Okay. Well, maybe I'm not meant to be at the table first. Maybe I'm meant to be over here. Probably not, but, you know, 
you know, you never know. All right, well, ooh, what is going on? That was strange. Okay, I think there's something else I need to do. can't do anything here either. I'm, I'm so dumb. Oh, what'd you say? Recess with electrical connections inside. Okay, so something drops in there. Uh, all right. Does, oh, I can't look down. All right, moving on. There's got to be something that we can do here. Oh. This looks like where film reel will go. If only I had some film reel. Huh. What, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm looking at a window. What? the lens it would not seem so all right um, stuff up there uh, and then we have this table Recess with electrical. Okay, so I'm supposed to do something. Hmm. Okay, well that's looking a little bit more promising. Still not able to do anything though. Uh, oh, here we go. Subject Alpha 17. Lamprina Atur Urata. Subject unresponsive to post mortem app of serum O4. Comb with electrical stimulation of range 10 to 100 um, milliamps. Is that MA? Um, corpus corpus degra degradation. Degradation. Degradation considerable with high empress. Uh, conclude. Corpory. Big words. Conclude. Col e. Coleoptera. Unsuitable for further study. Well, that's a crying shame. Uh, okay, so we have another thing here. Does it actually do? Uh, okay, that's looking at the table. I have a feeling that something needs to be on before this can do anything. Okay, so maybe I... If I'm to guess... Oh, there's something in there. I can't see what it is. The screw is holding the hatch shut. Unlock it! Come on! Let's go! Alright, well, we are certainly missing stuff here. Uh, can I go under the table? Can I go under the table? Does not seem like I can go under the table. I need to put something in there before I can move the handle. Ugh. All right. Okay, well. All right, there's some stuff where we can open up. 
Definitely not opening it up now. One. <gasps> One. Uh, part of the plaque is missing. <gasps> Screwdriver! Yay! Uh, beta 4. Radis Radis. Subject. Necrosis significantly halted by pre-mortem app of serum O5. Temporary uh, muscular muscular <laughs> reflex restoration witnessed with post-mortem electrical stimulation of range 75 to 85 milliamps. Okay, so I have a feeling that we're going to need those amperages for whatever we're going to be doing here. Star-shaped indentation. Can I... No, I can't look at anything there. Because this is useless. Can I zero in on the book? No, book's not important, apparently. All right, well, it did seem like there was only one place where we can put the screwdriver, so let's put it here and see what happens. There we go. Wooden box. What's in the wooden box? A wooden box. Six, six, six. All right, well, we need to open this up. So I think maybe we need this area. It has been a while since I did this. Okay, so two S's and that tells us one. So is that, uh, and then the S with the line through it is all the way over here seven yep it's given us the code so next two sticks one shorter than the other which is this one right here three <sighs> it's open a battery hooray and then are we done with the box? We're done with the box. All right. Thank you, little sand shape thing. Uh, okay, so can we put the battery? We can. We can take the battery out. We can put the battery in. We can take the battery out. Uh, okay, so we need to charge the battery. I think that's what we need to do here. Uh, but let's read this note because it says range from 10 to 100 milliamps. So uh, there was another recess for a battery. It was, was it over here? No, I think it was on the desk. I think it was on the desk. Right, recess. That one right there. <sighs> Lock in place. Can we? Oh, do I just have to spin it quickly? Charging technology of the past. Let's take our newly cha charged Duracell. Now we got some, we got some stuff going on. I'm liking it, I'm liking it. All right, so. <sighs> and now it's pointing. All right, let's just make sure it's pointing right where we want it to, which I believe is right here. Oh, I'm blind. There we 
go. It's doing stuff. A star-shaped handle. Well, we saw something star-shaped before. All right. And, uh, well, let's go to uh, star-shaped. I believe it was over here. Yep, down here. Click. Two. The room two. Oh, what are you doing? Room two, what are you doing? You so cray cray. A drum of images. Well, gee. Dear Professor de Mont Montefusen. Montefusen. Well, I don't doubt your altruistic nature. Your sister's condition is not aided by her continued confinement to your estate. I beg of you to see Madame Lucy return to the sanitarium as early as can be arranged. Yours, Dr. Bouchette. Eh, good for him. But I think that's all we need from here. We still need to unlock stuff. We have a roll of images. So one would make me believe that it needs to go here. <laughs> it does. Oh, the battery needs to go in there too. If I take the battery out of the thing, will the thing still work? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh no. Everything's locked in place. I can't do that. Alright, well, I can't do that. Do I need another battery? Can I get another battery? Recess with electrical connections inside. Okay. We get it. Something else you need. Alright. Uh, does this table offer anything now that it's uh, perhaps doing stuff? Use the screwdriver. We should be able to use the screwdriver somewhere else. Jimmy the lock with the screwdriver. I, I should be able to do it. Come on. Ugh. to that shield or anything. All right. I can't go to that mirror on the wall. Where can I go? Ah, 
giant water bug. Ew, it's so creepy. Okay, well, it's a water bug. What do we do with it? Did I miss opening up that thing because I didn't do switch number one? All right, that's... <laughs> Yep, I'm being dumb. <gasps> oh, insects! So... You go there. Appears to be specimens missing. Oh, what a crying shame. Oh. here. A large handle. Oh. More notes. Subject A. Upper right appendage severed at glenohumeral joint. Uh, necrosis in subject halted completely via pre app serum number five followed by post app of serum number four and Yada, yada, yada. All right. Uh, okay, so I'm guessing there's some laser that needs to come here. Uh, and maybe that's what will unlock the other side. Okay, so now we just need to know where this handle goes. Um, Doesn't look like, no, I don't want to read the note again. No, I don't want to read the note again. If I'm supposed to get into that, there's part of the plaque missing. Okay, so I'm just not meant to be here yet. All right, well, all right, I have a handle. Oh, you know what? Yeah. No. No. Something can fit in there. Is it not the handle? Yes, it is the handle. Uh -huh. Let's rotate. Do I do I not get that? Oh. Move it. Oh right, it's crystal. Never mind. I'll get it. us light. Right? <laughs> okay, now what? Okay, you're... I'm lasering all over the place here. Ah, alright. Ah, I'm blind! I knew it. Another battery, please. Uh, oh, and I got another bug. Another bug to go in my specimen collection. All right, well. Now that we have another battery, let's charge her up. Ooh. 
with our recharging of the past. Come oh, on, blew the flux capacitor. Now I'll never make it to 1987. Burnt out fuse. I'll discard it. I don't need this thing. Uh, what did I say? I need to replace the broken fuse. Okay. I broke it, I bought it, I guess. Right, well, where is another fuse? Tell me I don't have another fuse. More stuff. Dear Lucy, forgive me. I was too late. Now, well, I guess medical tonics. Uh, all right. Well, that's dandy. Is there anything I can do? Is there? Uh, what's there's a plaque missing there? Is there anything? Is there anything fuse like? had in any of these. Alright, no, nothing here. Fools. Write in the comments if you know where the fuse is. Because I do not. Stop looking at the note. I do not care for it anymore. make sure that the other drawer doesn't have anything of value. Just that letter. And maybe we'll check some stuff out with the, the lens. The lens knows. piece of the broken plaque. Thank you, Lens. This is why you have to have the Lens. And it also give us, gave us the clue for the bug on the... Uh, a fooze! I got a fooze. No. Alright. Nothing underneath there. Got it. Alright. Back to this table. Give me my battery now. Oh. Sorry, do I need to rotate? Not gonna blow this time, are you? Nope. 
back here. We need to battery that. Oh, we got the moving picture. With lens, without lens, I don't know. Yee. You got yourselves a good old Frankenstein's monster there. Is <laughs> looking back. What the heck did I just see there? Yeah, that's. You need the lens. The oh. Oh. A green ground beetle. All right. Uh, and then let's go back to this table. Is that pattern here at all? Somewhat. Six. Sixty. Maybe? You know, keep that in mind just in case, but... We need to put our new bug from there. Metal handle. Yep, it is a metal handle. I'll give it that. Uh, metal handle. Then do we do we use the table for this then? Oh, we still don't have the key for that. Huh. No on that front. Huh. Need a metal handle. Where do I need a metal handle? Where can I handle the metal? Almost seems like I don't need a handle there. Uh, all right. Bug is missing. Should be the stag beetle. All right, fair enough. So I believe it is 60, but 60 what? What are you trying to tell me with 60? Get what that is. What is that? <sighs> the strangely shaped key. Ah, that's got it. Okay. Took me a minute to get it, but I got it. So, strangely shaped key. Uh, nope, you're going around this way. So, this strangely shaped key has a triangle head and then arms and legs. So that's what we need to make this the shape of, which we do. 
And there we go. Open. Give us our beetle. And let's go back to the display case. Uh, and in the center. Doink. Uh, there's our last laser finder. But will it actually let us move the laser now? It should. Go. Yep. Um. It's amazing that uh, that blindness isn't uh, <laughs> the cause for most of these room games. All right, and. Oi! Uh oh. I sense there's another note. A lens. Looks like it would fit in my eyepiece. And it does. Without me having to do anything. Welcome. Seems to be my fate to be forever standing on the shoulders of greater men, like you, protagonist. Montefusen's Montefusen Montefusen's work here makes mine appear that of a child, but he never cracked the final secret to the doors as I have. He carried with him the key all along, and he never realized. The soul is the root of the null. You mean the null was inside us all along? It comes down to the simple trade. Mine for hers, and hers for yours. The heart is the seat of the soul, Mr. Anderson. Travel well, and don't look back. Whatever you see here, don't ever look back, Agent Smith. All right. Well, um, <laughs> what will this do now? Uh, uh, there be hieroglyphs all over my room. All right. What would oh. The little diamondy shape. Oh, is that? Uh, do I have to do a sequence? Don't spin the camera. Just checking out all these scribblings just to make sure. Yep, there's number one. One is. Pyramid. Uh, one is pyramid. You're going to tell me what number two is. number two. I don't see anything for number two. I mean, I guess I could brute force it if I needed to, but you've given me all the hints up until now, so might as well get number two. Make sure there's nothing underneath there that I need to look at. Oh, the book. The book. The book has it. The book has it. Can I look down at the book? Okay, so pyramid, uh, outside type star, star David type thing, and then diamond. Uh, okay, so let's go back to the table, all the way around to the other side, and 
do we need to do? One. Two. being literal when they say in the heart. Uh, okay. Almost there. <laughs> the heart beats. Okay, I'm not looking back. Room. It's the room. It's the room. Uh, okay. Um. Sells the room, the room. Back. It told you never to look back. Yeah, the null means business. Game complete. Congratulations, you've completed the room two again. Uh, where many have faltered, you have succeeded in discovering the many mysteries held within the most unique space. You fled the laboratory and escaped the confounded house where it all began. Yeah, the um, those uh, shots at the uh, ending cinematic, those were the first puzzles that we um, did in the room one. So nice callback there. After much scientific study, I can only conclude that it is an absolute impossibility that the null sample under my curiosity sorry, under my custody, is the only one in existence. It seems to reason that there must be a great number of somehow coordinated samples which exert some form of control over these curious events. Professor D. Montefusen, 19th November, 1903. Continue. Thank you for playing. We hope you've enjoyed this experience playing The Room 2, the second game we've made here at Fireproof Games. Yeah, hats off to you, Fireproof Games. You make one hell of a series. Uh, as a small, independent games developer, we truly believe in the power of word of mouth and goodwill from our customers. If you enjoyed our game, please rate it in the store and purchasing and recommending. Uh, the Room 2 uh, by, uh, by purchasing and recommending The Room 2, you are helping keep independent games development alive, so thank you very much. Uh, we sincerely value your support and look forward to being able to release another game in the future. Or another two or three, from what I understand. Um, yeah, hopefully they uh, continue on with this, because if there's ever a Room 5 or Room whatever subtitle they want to call it, uh, I will be front in line because uh, um, I enjoy playing them. I enjoy bringing them to you guys. And uh, it still seems like the my series for The Old Sins uh, gets a lot of traffic from people who are just trying to uh, work through that game. So 
I'm more than happy to uh, provide them some answers if they desire it. Um, but that is The Room 2 in completion. Uh, if you enjoyed this series and want to see me play through The Room 3, uh, drop me a comment and uh, let me know how it goes. Like I said, uh, who knows <laughs> next time February rolls around uh, if I just don't go ahead and do that anyway. If you enjoyed the series, uh, smack that like button. Uh, it helps me know that uh, there are people out there enjoying the content that I'm creating for them. Uh, so I hope you are. Uh, anyway, this has been Shin Virtuality. Game on, have fun, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.